You're Greg. You just finished an 8 hours shift at Walmart and as you leave to your car you run into one of your buddies in the parking lot and he introduce you to an alien. What do you do? Inform alien that I work at Walmart but do not divulge any further information until you've dated him for 3 months. Then you clarify that you are not a cashier. Hand the alien a job application. If he gets hired, I get a $250 referral bonus. Instructions unclear. Gave the alien a $250 hand job. I thought you were into cat girls not aliens. Showcase my low mileage 2011 Honda Accord. Supreme power move. Well, I just spent 8 hours in a Walmart. I'm getting lit. Alien can join or whatever. Ah uh, so, I'll smoke you out if you show me some cool alien shit. Dot. Fill him in on the Area 51 raid. Time for the alien to call for backup. Well, I have heard, somewhere backslash that Greg is a super nice guy. So, if I was Greg, I would just have a polite and honest talk with the alien. Call up my good friend Greg. He should know what to do. Clap cheeks. Is the alien the rock slash ah slash Greg fuck it a rock? Go home I'm tired. I create a YouTube account for the alien and subscribe and turn on notifications for Danny Gonzalez for him. That way he becomes truly Greg like my friends and I. We are now legally blood related and he gains Earth citizenship. We cry, hug, and celebrate despite knowing that our battle against the Craigs in Area 51 is only beginning. Wonder how I time traveled to the 21st. Ah, traveler 233. Welcome to the 21st. The director sent you, because he thought it would be funny. Say, man, you got a joint? It'd be a lot cooler if you did. I tell the alien that I work in the government when in actual fact I am the president. Pull out my phone, open up slash r slash people of Walmart, sort by top posts of all time, and ask the alien if he knows any of those people or if they are actually human. Yes, let's make Greg a meme. I'm here for that. Isn't he already? Like good guy Greg was a thing. Not the craziest shit I've seen today. I take my friend to the ER and explain to them that he has a drug addiction and is tripping balls and claiming he is seeing aliens. I then go back to my car and say shkiok banage shjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjjj
I chat with him about life and mention how nobody cares to ask about what the fuck is my job at Walmart. Are you trying to frick Rose Quartet? Quartz? I'm old Greg. You go get your son Steven, it's probably one of his friends looking for revenge on his mother or something. Form a relationship with the alien and tech them about human culture and as such, human intimacy, and how to shape themselves to be capable of such. Grow the relationship further much to the chagrin of the alien's ex-alien lesbian lover. Eventually get the alien pregnant only to have her shapeshift into your new son, dying in the process. R slash Grig rock Came here from r slash Grig rock to give you a well-deserved upvote. I applaud you sir. I would walk up to him and extend a hand and say buena noches soy Greg Benvenido America. Como estas? I politely inform my friend that we can't call Asian people that anymore. Wondering, since when have I had a friend? But if I've just seen an alien, anything is possible I guess. That just sounds like a typical day at Walmart. Well there is no Walmart in my country so I assume I've been teleported in the US. So I run away as fast as possible and hide before ICE gets me for illegal immigration and stealing an American citizen emblematic job. Say, I'm old Greg. You ever drink Baileys from a shoe? Go to the pub for a pint of bitter. Don't forget your towel. Hum sing a song to woo her about living life awesomely like a comet. Fall in love with said alien who's like 7 feet tall. Show her my van, chill and occasionally fight with her squad. Get her pregnant and she gives up her body to have our son and he goes off fighting other random space aliens. And come with learning she's a war criminal and what not. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Let me drive my van into your heart. I know I'm not that rich. I'm trying to get my start. So let me drive my van into your heart. Let me drive my van into your heart. Fuck IT to death. Well, apparently I fuck it and make a half human half gem son that inherits her gem and powers, but it's not her, even though all the other gems think so. It'd be about that time that I'd notice that my buddy was a 10-story tall green scaly creature from the Mesozoic era. And I'd be like goddamn Loch Ness monster got me again. Monster I ain't given you no goddamn tree fiddy, so you just go the hell to target and get a new job and get your own goddamn tree fiddy. Dot. Take him to mom's house for a tasty dinner, maybe shoot some hoops. Play some human music for him, have a couple beers. Assert dominance as the leader of Earth. Can't believe my friend just introduced me to my mom, who finally admits to me that she really was an alien doing bad a human impression after all these years. My YouTube career is going to start with a drunk alien, take that T-series and PewDiePie. You asking for advice bro? Punch it in the face, I don't want to deal with this shit right now question why I am now Greg. Ask him if he likes Baileys. Asking for a friend. We talking illegal or extraterrestrial? If it's an ET, I'd probably ask if he wanted to smoke weed, lifelong dream of mine. If he's an illegal alien, probably take him out for a beer and to see some big American titties. A slash suspiciously specific. Take the alien to Area 51 and tell them to shove it up their ass. I'd fuck a rock. I'm old Greg. Guess it's time to work the old universe charm. Is this our slash writing prompts now? Take him home and get high with him. I ask the alien if he's ever drunk Baileys from a shoe. Fuck it, the first Talon human baby I'll be famous. For all the wrong reasons. Kill the alien and GT, take it home and GT, cook it nice and GT, eat him and GT, gain the title alien eater and GT, go to sleep and GT, alien sister and brothers come and GT, take you with the UFO and GT, at their home planet they tell you whoever eats our king will be our new king, that's the law and GT, be new alien king and GT, use alien cocaine and alien hookers and GT, Get some alien kids and GT, plan the destruction of Earth and GT, attack the Earth and slave whole humanity and GT, leave and smile. Fuck the alien and see what pops out. I kidnap that bitch and sell it to Russia. 
who is Greg? Is he a fictional character like Karen? He was a guy mentioned in a previous post saying if an alien told you to take me to your leader, who would you take it to? Or something like that.